Hi, uh, thanks uh, for watching our YouTube channel. Um, today is going to spend a very quick uh, on our new generation's uh, Omega floodlight. Uh, this is what is the uh, Omega Mini that we have shown you a few months back. Okay, uh, but uh, also want to tell you that uh, for the Solar Omega floodlight, uh, we have a new upgrade. This is with me is actually is the third generation's uh, Omega uh, floodlight. As you can see, is a design based on a very uh, industrial grade uh, design and is a very robust and reliable light. And some of you already have been using this uh, quite some time, and you guys probably love this light is because uh, the build quality is uh, very good, and not to mention about the brightness was uh, supreme. So yeah. But for us, uh, we do not stop from there. Uh, we uh, continue to do our parts to, uh, you know, bringing the fourth generations the uh, Omega Flood Light. So I want to introduce to you. Uh, this is our fourth generation. Okay, what you can see, uh, first thing you see is actually, you find out this light is actually um, very very compact and very very small size. Okay. But uh, do not need to worry, um, you will find out actually uh, everything in this guy uh, will be put in here. But what we do is actually is we make it into a very very compact, compact and a very very light way. Okay? And the power output is the same. This is uh, you can run running from 10 watt to uh, 20 watt, 30 watt up to 50 watt. And this guy as well, uh, you can start with 10 and 20 and up to 50. Okay? But of course, these days, um, hardly people use uh, 50 watt uh, LED anymore because the lumen per watt is very high. For example, for this uh, new generation, the fourth generation's uh, Omega Flood Light, uh, we have achieved uh, 140 lumen per watt. 140 lumen per watt. So normally, when you have a 10 watt uh, LED, uh, you can you know produce about 1,400 lumens, and it's good enough. Uh, for especially for solar light application, yeah. Um, why why we want to make it so compact? You know, if compared to you know the predecessor, the Omega Flood Light, the Mini Omega, why why we want to make it smaller? Okay, it's uh, there's a lot of reason, yeah. Uh, a lot of customer feedback. Uh, in fact, actually, you'll find out most of the customer uh, they use it in all kind of application, yeah. Uh, for example, for example. If this guy is making into a very small, uh, you can use this uh, in in even wider application. For example, um, you can install this small light, yeah, because it's so compact. But of course, it's powerful. You can install in the you know in uh, automotive. For example, you can install at the back of the pickup trucks or a van, yeah. So when you need a uh, you know light operation, uh, you can just mount it on your pickup truck. Or, or at your back of your van and you can use it you know, to light your area. For example, uh, some of our marine customers, they like to install this line into their boat, all right, to their ship and because it's small. All right? So because it's small, uh, you also can you know, bring it around and put in a power pack and you, know, you can light up. And it's not like the old one, it's heavy, all right? three times heavier, three to four times heavier. Spouky is big, yeah, but now small and light, yeah, small and light, and you 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 can do all kind of uh, you know. Last time you are unable to do this guy is because it's big, but now it's small. Uh, you can do all kind of uh, uh, application, yeah. So in a short while, probably uh, wait until dark. Uh, I will show you the uh, performance uh, of the light. Okay, all right.
So this is um, going to give you the rough idea how bright and how small. Uh, when well you can you see this is my little hand and this is the new generation Omega uh, floodlight. It is very very small, uh, very compact kind of design. But this design would not sacrifice uh, the brightness of the uh, Omega floodlight. So our idea is actually is to have a small size, very very small size, compact uh, Omega floodlight. Uh, you know that can be easily mount on uh, any area uh, that you think fit. Uh, you know, use it as a general lighting, compound lighting. You know, signboard, billboard lighting, security lighting, all kind of uh, lighting that you can think of. Uh, this is will be uh, the light that gonna be used, and you will see more of this. Uh, we call it this is the fourth generations uh, uh, Omega uh, flood light, and uh, probably I will not point this at, at at you because I don't think the lens. Uh, can handle uh, the brightness of this uh, light. Okay, so there you have it. All right, you really have the uh, output, you know, the power output that you require uh, for for this. Okay, probably um, just to show you a bit on how do I hook on this uh, light. Okay, basically it's just a very small uh, SLA battery, 4.5 uh, AH and what I can show it to you um, is the um, watt meter that I have installed in the light Okay, alright, as you can see, um, try to zoom in Okay, um, The light actually only consumes roughly about 10 watt, okay, you can see that then what jumping okay uh, 0 0.82 uh, 0.72 a all right jumping okay it's 12, 12 volt 10 watt okay all right so it's only consumed about 10 watts and you know the output is in terms of lumen is unbelievable Okay, so basically, we no longer can use uh, watt size to measure the brightness of light. Okay, in these days, uh, especially uh, LED concern. Okay, the all time people always like to say how many watts of the light, but it's not a right uh, you know measurement for it anymore, because these days, uh, with the LED technology, basically you want something to be. Uh, consume a very little power all right the smaller watt size as possible but the lumen output uh, you know as big as possible yeah so by doing so uh, you become a very energy efficient uh, kind of lighting yeah so this is the idea of uh, you know using LED uh, you know solar things like that yeah so you can see okay basically light up with this uh, area just you know with few of these uh, new generation uh, Omega uh, Fertilite. Alright, hope you enjoyed this uh, presentation. Thank you.